How to set up carousel ads on Facebook. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you how easy it is to set up the carousel ads into your Facebook account or your Facebook ads manager. It is very easy and very simple. All you need to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you're going to be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is to head over facebook.com, sign in into your account until you see here the account uh, as you can see, Favicon, also the pages. The first thing that you need to do is to make sure that you have at least one page and a one functional ad account. So let's go ahead and let you see how we can create a page. So let's pretend that we are on the uh, profile page here. Now we are going to click on see more. And from here, we are going to see page. Or pages we are going to click on it it will contain the uh, or be represented with a flag or right their pages now if you do not have a page click on create a new profile or page choose a public page click on next and then you are going to set up here the bio the title and also the link of the page now once you have did that you're going to get the access to the ads manager so basically what are we going to do here on the profile page as you can see we're going to head over ads manager by seeing here the statistic uh, artwork or vector right there. This is it. You're going to click on it and it will take you right there to the ad manager. Once you are going to be here, if you do not have a ad manager account, you're going to create it by putting up here the name of the manager, the uh, right there, the statistics, some of the details that you have here. You're going to put uh, the details of your credit card and everything. So after that, you're going to see everything in here. Here we have the dashboard. You can see the campaigns, the ad reports, the audiences, uh, the billing and payments, and etc. Now, uh, here on this ads manager, you need to set up the pixel. So obviously, you are going to head over the events manager, open it, and set up the uh, pixel. Normally, in the case that you are watching this video, you know basically how to set up the pixel. You're going to head over to the data source. Right there, you can go ahead and see your pixel. If you do not have, you can go ahead and create right there a custom conversion or a new pixel. So let's ignore that. Here we are on the campaigns. So we are going to start from here. We have the campaigns, the ad sets, and also the ads. So we are going to create a special campaign here or a new campaign. So we are going to click on the green button, create. Now we are going to choose the uh, goal or the main focus of that campaign or the objective. For example, we have the awareness, the traffic, engagement, leads, uh, promotion, and sales. If you have here a, a website, you are going to create a new campaign based or the objective is here the leads if you are going to create for example uh, a special let's say post or a carousel where there that is going to be uh, supporting your uh, let's say here um, the page that you have you are going to get some engagement and etc so we are going to select here leads click on continue uh, then we are going to click on continue again so we are going to complete the three uh, ad or their settings. So we are going to change here the campaign name, for example, carousel. Uh, let's say here, uh, shoes ad. Then we are going to ignore the categorization. So this is uh, the campaign name. We're going to let here or uh, set up everything from here, uh, like the advantage. A campaign budget and also the a slash b test we're going to click on next you are on the ad set so we are going to choose for example the conversion location if it is a website an instant form a messenger uh, for example instagram whatever so basically i'm not going to choose uh, the instant form but let's go ahead and generate leads by starting chats in Messenger. This is the most convenient one. So we are going to select here the uh, Facebook page. And 
I am going to let everything from here. So we have a problem here. But it doesn't matter. So we're going to put it like that. Now, what are we going to do is to set up the budget, for example, 10. I don't know here, we're going to put it here in this currency or this uh, local currency. Here we are going to set up the start and end date, for example. We're going to stop the campaign at the uh, 14th of December at this specific time, but we're going to put it maybe as 11 or 23. So let's go ahead and put, for example, 23. It is going to be like this. So it doesn't matter. BM, BM, like that. Now, here you can go ahead and set up the budget scheduling. Here we have the uh, audience controls. So, I highly recommend for you to let the uh, right there the minimum age 18 because you are going to make it as broad as possible. For the location, go ahead and select your location. The uh, languages is going to be here uh, broad as possible, also all languages. If you want to use the advantage plus audience, you can go ahead and get a suggestion. It is optional, but in my case, I will let it like this because it is the first time that we are going to launch this specific uh, ad. So for the placement, you're going to get the placement plus right there. So you can go ahead and modify it, but I'm going to ignore that. I'm going just to click on next. Here we are on the ad. So we are going to rename it here as shoe, for example, carousel. And we are going to set up here the identity as the Facebook page, the Instagram account that we have here. It is going to be needing that you have an Instagram account or in case you do not have, it will uh, publish right there the, uh, on Instagram as the Facebook uh, page. Now we are going to see here the ad setup. So either you are going to create a new ad, use an existing post or say use a creative hub mockup. Now for the creative, normally we are going to get here the carousel option. So I do not see it, but we need to set it up. So in case you do not see here the carousel, we are going to be back to the uh, carousel shoe. Uh, right there or the first campaign here we are going to get the button of uh i'm going to let you see here something we're going to get the button to the tailored message campaign you're going to see all the presets for the presettings and click on edit this campaign manually so we are going basically here to see uh, the ad carousel so we are going to head over here again since we have a shoes the manual setup and boom you're going to see the format that has been changed we have single image or video and carousel so we are going basically to select carousel and from here we are going to set up the carousel cards we have up to 10 carousel cards we're going to select your videos or images for example this one that one and that one we're going to select those and here we have selected three cards at least you can add up to 10 i have told that you can also edit the placement to or select the placement to edit for example the uh, facebook feed right there the instagram stories whatever here you are going to set up here one of the five uh, primary text that you have for example to uh, for example collection and here we have it then you're going to set up the advantage plus creative you can add here the enhancement turn it on or off whatever uh, then we are going to see the message template tracking and etc when you finish everything this is the carousel preview like that like this on instagram you click on publish and here we have it that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one